from a station working for you. This is a WRTV update. And I'm Lauren Casey with your latest headlines. A motorcycle rider rushed to the hospital overnight following a crash on the city's north side. The crash happened just before 2 o'clock this morning near 86 in Meridian. What led to the crash remains unclear this morning, but our photographer did see one car with damage sitting nearby. Authorities in Owen County made an arrest in connection to a homicide there. Deputies say the driver found Elizabeth Stevens dead north of Spencer. Authorities say Stevens and the suspect were both passengers in a car when the shooting happened. Owen County deputies say that the suspect was arrested overnight at the Indianapolis International Airport. And Indiana lawmakers will release another round of maps in a once in a decade redistricting process. The newest maps will adjust the state Senate districts based on new population data. On Monday, the House Elections Committee voted along party lines to approve the new state and U.S. House maps. The House maps still need to be approved by the full House. A final vote is scheduled for the Senate next week. Let's get a check right now of our Tuesday forecast with Todd Clausen. Hey, Todd. Yeah, the umbrella needed here, Lauren, as rain chances are really going to ramp up as the afternoon goes on. And then this evening, it's pretty wet across the area. Let me take you through today and into tomorrow. Again, the rain chances with some thunderstorms possible this afternoon with locally heavy uh, downpours. Not expecting a severe weather. That's the good news, but there could be some lightning. But temperatures falling into the upper 60s as we work our way into this evening. Once the rain starts, look for a fairly steady rain over night tonight and then it kind of tapers tomorrow afternoon to more in the way of scattered showers. But look at the temperatures tomorrow. Tomorrow afternoon we're only going to be in the 50s and then eventually into the 40s by Thursday morning and that's not even factoring in the wind. Wind chill values tomorrow will be in the 40s so likely going to be a storm team alert day with one to two inches of rain a possibility. Lauren. Todd, thanks for more stories and weather you need to know. Just download the WRTV mobile app. Thanks for joining us.